So Samsung has recently unveiled their newest modern chipset, the Exynos 1380. This new chipset is the successor of the last year Exynos 1280 and features incremental upgrades. The Exynos 1380 supports UFS 3.1 storage and it is equipped with the advanced AI engine. Furthermore, the chipset now enables the integration of phones with full HD Plus resolution and 144Hz refresh rate screens as well as 200 megapixel primary camera. So in today's video, I will give you my in-depth review of the Exynos 1380 chipset. So sit back, relax and enjoy the review. The Exynos 1380 demonstrated exceptional performance, achieving one of the highest scores in the N229 benchmarks. The chipset surpasses its predecessor the Exynos 1280 in power efficiency and performance. The Exynos 1380's GPO delivers a total scores of 153,199, which is notably impressive and faster than its predecessor. Additionally, the CPU score is also among the best, with a total points of 150,539. The memory scores are also significantly improved, with a total points of 82,844. The UX performance is also noteworthy, achieving a total points of 125,438. Overall, the Exynos 1380 total points reach 530. 13,658, demonstrating remarkable performance compared to its predecessor and competitors in its price range. The Geekbench 5 performance test shows the Exynos 1380 single core scores of 781 and the multi core points of 2637. The similarity between the single core score of Exynos 1280 and Exynos 1380 suggests that the former use of same Cortex S78 architecture as the latter. However, the multi core scores of Exynos 1380 is 50% higher than the Exynos 1280, indicating a notable improvement in performance. This supercharged chipset makes your mobile experience smarter and better with an enhanced NPU that can do up to 4.9 trillion operations per second. With its advanced AI engine, the Exynos 1380 brings exciting new possibilities like advanced language recognition for AI assistance and better recognition in images for sharper visuals. The Exynos 1380 comes with a super smart NPU that can do some amazing things with your smartphone. With advanced computational photography technology, the NPU can detect different objects in your pictures like trees, skies, persons, faces and more and adjust the image processing accordingly. This means you get sharper details, more vibrant colors and smoother skin tones on your photos. The Exynos 1380 offers an unprecedented level of visual Comfort. Its display refresh rate of 144Hz at Full HD Plus resolution guarantees a seamless soothing experience with effortless scrolling. The chipset's adaptive tone control technology further enhances visibility in any weather conditions, including bright outdoor environments by adjusting the brightness and contrast according to the surrounding light. And if you are enjoying this video, then a sub to the channel will be excellent. Exynos 1380 provides users with effortless means of capturing professional grade photographs. Its advanced triple ISP is equipped with a cutting edge flagship technology, enabling it to deliver high end camera features. This IP can support camera sensors up to 200 megapixels and zero shutter lag for 64 megapixel images. Additionally, it features high dynamic range and electronic image stabilization for exceptional photography. The Exynos 1380 comes with a Wi-Fi 6 and a Bluetooth version of 5.2 and has a 5G support with an integrated 5G modem. It provides incredibly fast download speeds of 3.79 GB per second and upload speeds of 1.2 GB per second. This means you can enjoy lightning fast network speeds. So the Samsung Exynos 1380 has a total of 8 cores including 4 ultra fast cores that are based on Cortex A78 that are clocked at 2.4 GHz and the 4 other cores are power efficiency core that are based on Cortex A55 and are clocked at 2 GHz. So this combination of 4 efficient core and 4 ultra fast core makes the Exynos 1380 best choice for mid-range smartphones. And this processor is based on 5 nanometer process technology which leads to power efficiency and speed. The Exynos 1380 is designed to handle tasks that needs a lot of power, like doing things quickly or doing lots of things at the same time. To do this, it uses 4 of its ultra fast Cortex S78 cores. And for tasks that doesn't need too much power, it uses its 4 power efficiency cores that are based on Cortex A55. The chipset is designed to work efficiently and fast, so it performs well in any situations and doesn't waste energy. This improvement makes the Exynos 1380 a chip that works about 40% faster when doing the same things like running apps in the background, playing games or more and about 20% faster when loading games thanks to its UFS 3.1 storage technology. It's also about 30% more faster than chips 
when doing several things at once. The Exynos 1380 has a Mali G68 GPU featuring 5 cores that are clocked at 950 MHz that delivers powerful and stable graphics processing performance for immersive 3D gaming experience. With advanced APS support and enhanced performance, Exynos 1380 offers an unparalleled augmented reality gaming experience. Additionally, the GPU is also fabricated using 5mm technology, which means lower power consumption and power efficiency. The Exynos 1380 uses the quad-channel LPDDR5 frame with a memory frequency of 3200 MHz, and the chipset also uses the two storage technologies of UFS 3.0 and UFS 3.1. The Exynos 1380 chipset is both powerful and power efficient. With this chipset, you can expect faster performance and more power efficiency compared to its predecessor. The Exynos 1380 has also proven its capability in the Samsung Galaxy A54 5G, where it can handle demanding games like Call of Duty Mobile, PUBG Mobile S4 Line without any issues. If you are looking for a balanced performance, then the Exynos 1380 is a great choice. So this was my full review of the Exynos 1380. If you found this review helpful and useful, please consider subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to never miss a new video from our channel. And also if you like this video, then give it a thumbs up and leave your thoughts in the comment section below. So my name is Hamza, this is Headstack and see you in the next video. If you want to watch the full review on the Redmi Note 12 Turbo, then that video is right here. And if you want to watch the full review on the Exynos 3030, then that video is right here. Thank you for watching.